When the construction happened earlier this year, they decided to replace the gym doors with fire doors, and we noticed that the doors were solid wood, so we decided to take them. Um, we weren't sure what project we were going to use with them at that point, um, but the kids stripped all of the hardware off of them and got them kind of cleaned and ready to go. After that, we decided that um, another teacher here at the school, Mr. Wilson, um, was using some older tables and we could make a project with these doors to kind of have an innovative door project or an innovative table for them, including power or magnets. He teaches automation robotics and that kind of stuff. So we'll have eight different tables when we're completed and we will have eight different leg patterns within those tables. So all of the tables are going to be a little bit original and a little bit unique and that's what Mr. Wilson wanted. Um, he didn't want all of the stock tables, he wanted them all a little bit different. So the kids are designing not only the legs but the actual tabletop itself. Um, they're cutting the window hole larger so we can have storage and then they're also making a component for a power strip as well. So. The kids are doing a 100% design and build of this project. Well, it's a table and then the window that we're turning into a cubby storage is a 7 by 48 and we're adding another cubby storage underneath which will be 15 inches in and it'll go down by 5 inches so kids can put their book bags and stuff like that. difficult, pretty much. A lot of work, but they turned out fine. Pretty much just based it off a semi-truck with the low design with smokestacks on it, and that's about it. All right. that we have.